Okay, guys, welcome. Oh, fucking cop car. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, welcome back. Hello, cops. Yeah. Welcome back to another <laughs> vlog, guys. I'm with Grant Hi. here. We were just, uh, well, Grant was actually just deadlifting inside. <laughs> I just got here. Vitaly was uh, hanging out, giving him some pointers or whatever. Anyway, Grant, now, are you a Marine? Uh, I was. Got out about a couple years ago. Right now, I'm a firearms instructor and uh, I work at a gun shop, so. I get a lot of sweet discounts and I uh, definitely use that shit to my advantage. And he has a lot of really cool toys, which he's showing us. He was like, he was like, oh man, I just got this new piece. And I was like, well, show me a photo or whatever. And he was like, oh, it's in my car. And I was like, it's in your car right now. So anyway, he's showing us some of his, some of his guns. Uh, they're just badass. And as you can see, I mean, Grant's just the man. He's got the hookup. So I guess if you know, if you're ever in a firefight, this is probably the man to know, right? Yes. But anyway, he's got a couple others of his handguns here. He's got um, he's got his, a rifle too. Uh, just a bunch of badass stuff, really. I mean, I mean check people, this out. People are like driving by, like probably. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, this is America. <laughs> Nothing better than hey, guns in a hey. gym. <laughs> Look at that shit. Look at this shit. <laughs> Nothing better than guns in, in a gym. Um, this is a thumbnail. <laughs> the reason why I got this one in particular is uh, I'm a big fan of Glock. Yeah. And, oh, yeah. Um, yeah. Show me. Dude, can, so we see, idea... can we show them this hologram? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. So this is. Let, let me, me double check let it me again. See it. Can I, let me show it through the camera. Right. See if I can. You can kind of see it. Dude, look how freaking dope that is. So that's the that's the Holosun 510C, and we we uh, we actually have that at our shop. Dude, that's so dope. You can, so you can see it. Like the idea behind it, right? Is I'm a big fan of Glocks, right? Show, show. The nice thing about this, this is a lacrosse tape, by the way. This is the best thing you can put on your grip. It's cheap as fuck. Lacrosse and tape? Out. Yep, lacrosse tape. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and clear or pull the slide back make sure it's empty. Yeah, you're good. Wait, let me feel it. Right. Right. So, the idea is, normal tape uh, is pretty uncomfortable on the hand. Watch me point that. Keep down on the ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I, try. Um, I know. But I'm you're good, you're good, you're good. <laughs> I, just don't want I know, I know the whole down and away um, thing. The idea I, I, is, that's why I was kind of pointing it that way. Normal tape, you like there's nothing shit, like, there. Athletic tape on there that's just gonna get sticky and it's gonna come yeah, off. Right. Ath lacrosse tape stays on there really well. It's like five bucks. It's dope. Um, okay, one more. This looks like a Karen, so I'm gonna. <laughs> 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 He's all just right. casually anyway. waving. Okay. <laughs> anyway, all right, cool. So, anyway, Dude, um, what's dope about this? Since it takes Glock's mags, you can throw the 33 round mag in there. Dude, that's um, so it's actually quite nice. And then I daily carry my Glock 19 along with other guns. Um, and I was, just, America, out, I was just at my buddy's uh, land and I kind of put together a uh, DMR, if you will. <laughs> I used that on Call of Duty, man. This is I used that Call of Duty. Yeah, um, Dude, look how I like that. And you guys, you see he uses the 20 round mag so it doesn't get in the way of the bipod, too. Dude, that's so nice. Which makes a and lot a of cheap sense. Ass, it's a cheap-ass optic, but this rifle is really well put together. If you're looking for, like, a mid-tier AR-15, I recommend Rock River Arms. Uh, they're anywhere from, like, 1,000 to 1,500, but the fit and finish, phenomenal. Um, you need a discount And they're code. a lot better. They're a lot better. <laughs> we need Jesus a Christ, how many fucking a... people drive down this road? Dude, I thought this was, like, the back... This is, this is literally a back road in the middle of fucking nowhere, Lawrence, Kansas. <laughs> we've had like a cop and like fucking. It's like a highway. How many people have passed by? <laughs> a lot. But uh, yeah, so uh, Rock River Arms, I recommend if you want something that's gonna last a while. Dude, that's um, pretty dope. Fit and finish. Okay, is let's phenomenal. take let's take a picture with all that. Uh, shit. A picture with all of it. Yeah. Can we all take get a, in it? Yeah. I need to get you in the yeah, pic well, too. Yeah, I, I know. Like this. Bad boy. I tell he gets the clock. You get the clock. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, you, how, you we, how, are we gonna, how are we going to take the picture? That's gonna, well, I can take it. Here, take this. I'll take the picture. Take this big not. one. I'll All right, we're going to use this for <laughs> the thumbnail. The thumbnail <laughs> and then we'll have a picture with him as well somehow. We'll, we'll have to wait. No, that's good. I don't need to be in it. Okay, I'll take it. We're going to take a picture. Back to lifting. Yeah. Yo. <laughs> back to deadlift. Okay, guys. So Monday is chest, try shoulders. But what we're going to be doing um, is increasing the volume. We're going to—I'm going to show you guys just a nice total arm finisher that I like to do at the end of my workouts. So this is also going to do a little bit of biceps. And actually, we're going to start out with biceps, and I'll show you what we're going to do. We're going to do some dumbbell bicep curls. Uh, we're not going to do single arm though. We're going to be going both same time, and it's going to be a Zotman curl as well. So, up, twist, down slow. You guys know I like to go slower on the eccentric portion. So about two, se two second concentric, one, two, twist, three second eccentric. 
And this is gonna be for pretty much everything, not just the Zotman curl, but I like Zotman curls. Uh, I think that they hit like just the, pretty much the entirety of the bicep. So I like to keep that a staple in my arm workout, um, regardless of what I'm doing. So what we're gonna be doing is 10 reps for each three of these workouts. And next, one more. <laughs> good volume, good weight. Um, going over the shoulders, we're gonna be doing a dumbbell lateral raise. So once again, good 10 reps. And you guys know I really like volume. So honestly, I'll do this little circuit for five sets, honestly, you know? I don't think that, when it comes to really any secondary muscle group, I have no problem doing a ton of volume, even if it hurts a lot. And my shoulders are pretty weak from chest. Okay. Now over to my favorite, my favorite exercise. Andrew, thank you. Appreciate you, man. Favorite tricep exercise right now. What is this weight? What is this weight? Big man hitting this weight. That's uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who was that? Um, anyway, favorite tricep exercise is definitely going to be a tricep cable pull down. Um, and you guys will notice that when I get in, when I, how I set it up, I have a nice little bend, right? I kind of hinge at the hips right here. And then what I'll do is I'll kind of pin my elbows. Like imagine almost as if you're just pinning your elbows in the air and then I pivot from those elbows. Okay? So I'm not pulling with my shoulders, you know, I'm not doing nothing like that. This is gonna be a good isolated tricep extension. All time favorite tricep extension, pretty much for all my tricep exercises, I just always use the cables. I love cables and as we know, it keeps good resistance throughout the entirety of the movement. And if that's a little bit confusing, the whole resistance concept, I recently watched a video on it. It popped up on my TikTok. So I'll kind of explain to you guys what the dude on TikTok explained to me. So essentially, come on over here. Uh, actually, this is fine. So barbell, okay? Let's just say you're doing a, um, like a, a barbell curl, right? So at some point, in this lift, gravity is no longer pushing the bar down with the same resistance throughout the entirety of the lift, right? So, okay, we got gravity going down. Let's just say this is a 20 pound bar, 20 pounds, 20 pounds, 20 pounds. Okay, right about here. Now it's on past that, I don't know, imaginary line or some shit like that and gravity is no longer, now it might be just 10 pounds of downward pressure, all right? Well, the concept of the cable is that throughout the entirety of the lift, it's consistent, man. It is consistent, right? So, let's say 30 pounds, because there's not 20 on here, because gravity is working right here, if there's always gonna be, in this case, 30 pounds of downward force, I guess. Yeah, that's right. Throughout the entirety of the lift, right? So even after years of hearing that whole concept of resistance training, it never really clicked to me until I watched that video, okay? Because at some place throughout your lifts, if you're not using like a resistance band or cables, Gravity is not going to be always pushing downwards with the same force, unlike a band or a cable, right? So that's kind of the whole concept of using these cables or resistance bands or whatever it might be to keep nice, you know, tension throughout the entirety of your lift. So, you know, of course use everything, but that's another reason why I really like cables, especially when it comes to something like pec flies or real more like secondary muscle group training or isolation work. I think that it's really good um, to target those small muscle groups. 
consistently throughout the entirety of your lift. So that's just a little tip. That's a nice little arm day finisher. Um, of course, you know, if you want to, let's just say you're doing chest and, or you're doing a uh, triceps and shoulders, do a couple of your tricep workouts, do a couple of your shoulder workouts, but then hit that entire arm workout as your finisher, right? So your Zobman curls, followed by your lateral raises, followed by your tricep extensions. I think that that's a perfect finisher. And I mean, go heavy, go, go, go very high on your volume personally for all your lifts, but especially your secondary muscle groups. And then uh, I'm finishing up here. Vitaly's done with his CrossFit. So what we're gonna do now, <laughs> what we're gonna do now, we will see you guys at the house shortly. Okay, so just got back from the gym. Gonna go to KFC because originally it was a buy one get one chicken sandwich because the Chiefs won. Shout out Chiefs, although they're trash. This year, yeah, they're trash right now, which is unfortunate. And then I went to Chipotle <laughs> and then I looked across the street and I don't know if you guys have a Hawaiian Bros because I've never heard of them before. Like honestly, probably a year until or two. Page. Until yeah, probably Literally, until Page. Yeah, or until like like Lawrence essentially. I don't even know where they are. But anyway, and then I looked across the street and I was like, oh, there's Hawaiian Bros. I was like, oh, I want to get that. So check this stuff out. It looks fire, it, and it is. It's so good. Mac and cheese, got the rice and got this chicken. It's all so good. So yeah, I'm gonna uh, eat some of this, and then after that, we're gonna get back right here and uh, ship out some orders. Say thank you to some of you guys. Uh, we really appreciate that, of course, and then we will end the vlog. All right. Okay, just finishing up with this order here. Shout out Becky for the buying a shirt. We really appreciate you. Thank you so much. And to everybody, of course, that buys the programs as well. We got some awesome, uh-oh. Oh, I thought I just taped a hair in there. No, we're good. Okay, we can't show the address. <laughs> oh, you're right. Yeah, shout out Becky at, no, seven okay. Anyway, um, yeah, uh, thank you guys so much let's, for, let's say, at least. Yeah, we can, uh, Idaho. Oh my nice. Home. Becky in Idaho. Uh, yeah, thank you guys so much. Uh, even just pe people that buy programs, merchandise, anything, we greatly appreciate the support. Thank you so much. Um, if you're unaware, we do have Schmittness merchandise as well as hats and a couple other things, uh, hoodies, etc. And programs too. We got um, strength training programs, hypertrophy training programs, endurance programs. Uh, we even have a supplement guide. I think that's free actually on there. So you guys can check that out. Um, we greatly appreciate all the support. Thank you so much. Another way too, if you want to support as well as get some cool stuff, Young LA, you can use code Schmidtness. That greatly helps us. And then I got some awesome news coming for you guys in the coming week about some supplements. Um, a company that I've always loved, have been using for years and everything like that. Just kind of figuring out uh, the final steps for that guys so that's I'm gonna save that probably for next week's vlog but definitely stay tuned it's gonna be awesome I'm very excited to uh, work with this company support this company I love them and I'll give you guys some more information soon so um, besides that I think that wraps up today's vlog thank you guys so much for tuning in we greatly appreciate it uh, and stay tuned for more content guys so